War reduces people's wealth, even billionaires. As the Russia-Ukraine conflict escalates, the richest Ukrainians face huge economic losses. Oops. How much wealth have they lost? Where is their money kept? <laughs> There are about 10 billionaires in Ukraine, and most of them have assets in the country. That means their wealth is affected for sure. Forbes Ukraine reported that the value of assets held in the country had fallen between 20 and 40 percent in the days leading up to the attack, and the situation might be worse. According to the Bloomberg Billionaire Index, the wealthiest person in Ukraine, Renat Akhmatov, has lost at least $5 billion compared to last year. While it's impossible to get a full picture of these billionaires' assets, we can find some information about how billionaires protect their wealth. All billionaires use a common strategy to stay rich, even in a chaotic period of time. Diversification across a number of businesses and assets. Take Ukraine's richest man as an example. Renat Akhmatov owns Ukraine's largest industrial conglomerate, which spans in mining, energy, finance, media, and real estate. His companies operate in the US, Italy, UK, Bulgaria, and Switzerland. <laughs> also, he bought a penthouse in London and a mansion in France. What about the second richest man in Ukraine, Ihor Kolomoisky? He is the former owner of the country's largest private bank. But in 2016, the Ukrainian government nationalized the bank after Kolomoisky was accused of embezzlement. It's estimated that Kolomoisky's holdings of American real estate was worth about several hundred million dollars. Now he lives in Switzerland. Basically, billionaires have money everywhere. As the New York Times put it, Ukrainian oligarchs kept money in Western banks and investments and sent their children to live or study in Europe and the United States. So even if their assets in Ukraine are destroyed, their investments in war-free jurisdictions might be kept intact. Anyway, billionaires never put all their eggs in one basket. Thanks for watching. I'm Xiaoming Bao. We'll be back very soon.